Kelly's final rider for Hong Kong. Challenge the top order. As predicted by Matt Pointer. Well, as casual and relaxed as anything to go by, put your money on Ricky Chan because he went to the line with a big smile on his face, didn't seem to be too perturbed about the occasion of being the last heat on the track. He's going to get into 227 if he wants to see himself out on the pursuit bike again this afternoon. He goes through 2117, that's a very fast first lap and he looked very comfortable as he went through. Maybe he knows something we don't. Very, very powerful fast start here from the man from Hong Kong. He comes through in the home straight. Let's see what the 500 has to say. 37.8. So he's controlled that second lap. Let's see if that first lap was a little bit too quick or it's just very nicely controlled. So far, he hasn't moved the upper body at all. Seems to be hanging on to it nicely. Here comes Ricky Chan through the three laps. 55. That's where he needs to be. That's the sort of time he needs to be putting out to be getting inside that 2.30 mark. And what he wants to look for is the 2.27. Want to be coming through at about a 115, 116. If he's going to be there and thereabouts, he goes through in a 113.5. And young Luke Howe went through at about a 113, and he is our second rider on the podium in the positions at the moment. So 223, 224. Man from Hong Kong just has to go 227. Catches his opponent. That's usually a good indication of how they're going when they do catch their opponent. He didn't flick around the outside of him the way the coach possibly would have hoped, which means the legs are getting a little bit heavy. He's going to come through this time and get two laps left to run. 2.23 will get him into the gold medal write-off. I think he's going a little bit slower this time to be able to do that. 1.51. He's going to definitely give it a big throw to try and get in that top four. Third and fourth on the track at the moment is a 24-6 or a 27-0-8-1. He's going to come into the home straight this time. Get behind the young man from Hong Kong. He's trying to make the top four. He goes through now. He's going to have to have a very, very big last lap. He's going to have to go through about a 17 and a half. Can he lift in this last half lap? It doesn't look like it at the moment, but he's not going away just at the moment. I think we're just going to be inside the 230 mark here for the man from Hong Kong. So the final four isn't going to be disrupted. He goes through 229, 468. It's a solid ride, but our top four will not change as Luke Spin goes round to finish off his ride. Big round of applause for our Midland Red Rider as he goes down the back straight. He'll finish off his individual pursuit here this afternoon.